to love thee with my dearest king. There are, I'd say, three ways we can participate well and, and actively grow in our uh, participation in the Eucharistic re revival. And one, it's to learn about it and learn about the Eucharist, right? Two, to talk about it, tell people about it. And three, to participate in liturgies that elevate it, that point it out and say exactly what it is, right? Waiting to hush our latest breath. I loved it. I loved it. And it was very proud. This is where I went to college, and it was just very awesome to walk these grounds uh, with Jesus and the Blessed Sacrament right in front of me like that, and to see the other students stop and stare and wonder what it was about, and hopefully they will seek and they will find. But uh, it was a, an awesome experience for me, and uh, to be with these wonderful, wonderful young people is just amazing. Well, for me, it's like very, very important because it's as well indirectly also already prepare us so that we may not only be here in the church, but also having that opportunity to really testify our life, Christian life publicly. For me, it's like very as a priest, it's so, so beautiful. And also I'm very, very excited that there are so many young people who are actually uh, excited to testify their life, Christian life publicly.